What's up everyone, this is Danny for Gadget Hacks here with the Note 3. Now the Note 4's apps have been leaked on the internet and they're available for downloads as APK files. Today I'll show you how to download those and install them on your Note 3. Now you do need to have unknown sources checked, so I'll show you how to do that right now. Just go to Apps, go to Settings. Now in Settings, you want to go to General, Security, and in Security under Device Administration, check Unknown Sources right there. And after you do that, you're just going to go to the list I provided in the full tutorial, pick and choose which apps you want to download, then download them. After you have them downloaded, you just need to tap on them to install them. So let's go into My Files, All, Device Storage, go to Download, and then Download. Here I have my APK files. I'm going to show you how to install one of these apps right now. Let's install the new S Voice from the Note 4. Tap on S Voice. I'll prompt you to install as an update. I've already done this already, so I'm going to exit out of there. Now if you want to install the new S Health, you do have to have a custom recovery installed like Torp or if you're on a locked bootloader like me on my AT&T Note 3, you do need to have SafeStrap recovery. So let's boot into SafeStrap and I'll get that done right now. Power off the phone. Let's boot it back up. Just give it a few seconds. Since I'm on safe strap, it'll give me the options to boot into recovery in the bottom. There it is. Tap recovery. Now all you're going to do is download the zip file. You're going to flash it with safe strap or torp. And then you'll have a working S health. Let's go to install. Let's go to the right folder. Go to SD card. The SD card. Now in the SD card, you go back to your download folder. There's S Health. I'm going to tap on that. You're going to swipe to confirm flash. It's really fast, really easy. Now all I have to do now is just reboot system. And I show you off some of the apps I installed from the Note 4. Let's give it a few seconds to boot back up. To continue there. Just giving me a few more seconds. I'll swipe there. Now let's go to apps and let's check out the new S voice that we installed. That's the new flat UI. I can't find a network connection. Here I have airplane mode on, so it, it won't be connecting to the internet, but you get the idea. It's, it looks a lot nicer. Now let's also show off, let's see what's a good one. Let's go to downloads. Let's go to the Samsung Gear app. That's from the S4. Oh, the Note 4, excuse me. We can also go and check out the Smart Remote app. There it is. Just launch it. And then it'll work. It'll download all your uh, TV guide information if you set it up correctly. It's pretty cool. Now let's check out um, S Health. Let's see, S Health, oops. S Health, right there. Oops, there it is. It's the new S Health from the Note 4. Let's see, go to Food Tracker, Exercise Mate, there's Walking Mate, Comfort Level, set your weight, configure more in settings if you want. Now I also installed the new S memo. So let's check that out really quick. S memo. Let's see. S, S, where is it? S memo. There it is. And you can just make a new note. I'm going to use this a lot actually. Those are a couple of the Note 4 apps on my Galaxy Note 3. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe and check out the full tutorial on Gadget Hacks. Thanks and you have a good day.